Want to learn how to crochet the beautiful Trinity stitch? It has a star stitch like texture and it is so, so beautiful. Let me teach you how to crochet this stitch. It really is fun. So here we go. All right, in order to crochet the Trinity stitch, you're going to crochet a chain of multiples of two plus one plus one. So technically simply an even number. So let's do this. We're first gonna make a single crochet in a second chain from the hook. Simply go in and make a single crochet. Now I like going in the back bump, but it's totally up to you which loop you're going into. I just like the clean edge on the bottom. So now's the fun part. We're going to do three single crochets together. Okay, but we're not losing stitches, I promise. So you're going to insert your hook into the stitch that you just used to make a single crochet. So insert it, yarn over and pull through. You're gonna do the same in the next stitch, yarn over, pull through, and in the next stitch, yarn over, pull through. You're gonna end up with four loops on your hook, three of which are half finished single crochets. Now yarn over and pull through all and make one chain. Now we're going to repeat that. So insert your hook into the last stitch that you just used and yarn over, pull through. Do the same for the next two stitches. You again end up with four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through and chain one. Repeat it until the end, and then I'm gonna show you how to finish up this row. Once you reach the end, you're gonna skip the last chain that we usually make after this three single crochet together. Instead, you're gonna place a single crochet in that same stitch that you just used. So no chain of one, just a single crochet, just to make the edge even. Now the stitch looks very special in rounds, but I'm gonna show you how to do it in rows, right? So next you're going to turn over and you're simply going to repeat the entire process of row one. So start with a simple single crochet and correct, I do not chain one because I want a clean edge. Now, if you like to do a chain one, feel free to do so. I prefer skipping it because it makes it cleaner. Now we're going to do the three single crochet decrease again. Now that includes the chains that we made, right? So just like so, you're going to crochet your three single crochets together and then you do your chain of one. So again, you're inserting it into that previous stitch, then in the next stitch, and in the next stitch and one of the stitches was the chain right so now you're going to yarn over and pull through and chain of one repeat till the end and finish it up with a single crochet at the very last stitch even though you already used that stitch so now once you've done row one multiple times for a few rows, you are really going to see the beautiful pattern appear. Remember, it has a slightly different look, more of a star stitch look if you do it in rounds. If you're interested in how this looks like, be sure to check out my free pattern for the Trinity bag. This is a little cute project bag that you can make in a quick few hours. So go check that out. And if you want more tips and tricks, not only do you want to subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell but you also want to subscribe to my newsletter I have eight crochet tips that I can literally send you in an email and yes they're free so be sure to check that out and of course like comment and share this video with your crochet buddies if you enjoyed the stitch and the way I teach I appreciate you very much and I hope to see you next time bye